Once again, to Powich's Cranberry Valley Golf Course, Jamie Goodwin and myself are out here today with Dennis Hoy, the director. And uh, Dennis is going to uh, continue his uh, teaching on, what is it today, Dennis? Today we're going to be talking about uh, hitting uh, chip shots and shots around the green off of hills and tough lies. Tough lies, that sounds like almost every green has a little tough lie, and you always find that. <laughs> well, the funny, yeah, the funny part is usually when you miss a green, hitting into a green, it usually doesn't end up in a nice place. It's usually on a hill, in deep grass, or on a bank. So one of the things that's important to know is the way to attack that so you have a good shot at uh, saving your, your score. Well, very good. So we'll let you go ahead and show us that. All right. Thanks. Okay, uh, what we're going to be talking about today is uh, when you hit a shot in and around a green, but you don't hit the green, a lot of times what happens is your ball is going to roll up onto some sort of an uneven surface or a hill. And as you can see here, what we're doing here is we're taking a look at what happens to you and what you need to worry about when you're trying to hit a shot off of a bad lie or a hill, especially around the greens. Number one thing you want to remember whenever you're hitting chip shots around the green is, and especially when you're on an uneven lie, number one thing of most importance is to make sure that your balance is nice and solid, okay? So when you're on a hill around a green, one of the first things you want to do is make sure when you're standing on these hills is to try to make sure that your weight is not either level or heading backwards when you're going to hit the shot because then your weight is going to be pushing you downward towards the hill. So what, that hap what happens when you do that is you're going to lose balance and it makes it very difficult to hit the shot properly. So when you get to a hill, the number one rule that you want to do is try to make sure that you lean a little bit of your weight toward the hill to help you keep stable. That way when you go to hit the shot, it's much, much easier for you to stay level and hit the shot properly. That's the first step. The next thing you want to learn is when you're swinging on these different hills, one of the things that happens a lot of times is you got to remember when you're on a hill and the surface is like this, one of the things you have to try to do the best that you can is to one, get your shoulders level with the surface that you're hitting from. Okay, now even though I'm leaning, you see my shoulders are level with the hill. Okay, because when you swing the golf club, what you're trying to do is swing that golf club right along the hill. Okay, what happens a lot of times, people get on these hills, they lean, and they go to swing, and what happens is the club heads directly into the hill stops the club and they don't hit the shot properly. So what you're trying to do is make sure that everything is going so when you swing, your club is actually swinging right along with the hill and it makes it much, much easier to hit the shot properly. Now a lot of these steps are going to be the same whether you're hitting uphill, downhill, you just reverse what you do. So if I switch over and go down the hill, what I'm trying to do now is I'm leaning my weight back to keep level and again swinging right down the level of the hill and what that does is it's going to make, make it much easier to hit these shots solid. So what happens when you do these things, it makes it much easier when you go to hit these shots, when you get leveled and go to swing through, you're able to hit these shots and get them airborne, and it makes it much easier to make good solid contact and keep yourself nice and solid when you go to hit the shot. And this is something that many people get into all the time, but they don't have a plan of how to get themselves solid to go up and hit these shots. So it's really important when you're doing this to make sure, remember, number one is balance. Number two is try to get yourself level with the hill and swing level with the hill, and you can have a much better chance of being consistent with this type of shot. All right. You get that? Well, now, Dennis, I'll know how to hit a ball. I've been one of those guys that's always digging into the side of the hill. <laughs> well, that's, yeah, that's the funny thing is that that's a very common thing is that people forget when you're on uh, any of these uneven surfaces that when your golf club swings into the uneven surface, it's going to react poorly. So it's important to remember when you're going up or down a hill to make sure you try to swing the best you can right along with the hill. Well, I'll have to remember that. <laughs> <laughs> As usual, another good uh, information for golfers out there and uh, we hope that uh, you've enjoyed watching Dennis and that uh, you'll begin to put some of these things into your own personal uh, attack. So thank you again Dennis and oh, you're uh, hopefully we'll see you again real soon. All right thanks. It was a